I do with the crown. With the one, with the, the crown. The crown. The crown. You have to say it, crown. I do like. I do like a bit. Of the How crown. come? Why? So do the royals just have their own dialect, or is that like a super upper 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 crest accent? What is the Brit the royal accent? Are the royal family posh? Is your question? Well, like, and this seems borderline retarded. It is retarded. <laughs> it is retarded. Oh, the royal family. I remember once playing. Uh, I did a gig at Buckingham Palace, and uh, it was like for the jubilee. So it's like. <laughs> That's 200, a biggie. 250,000 people in front of you. Jesus and there's a lot more people watching at home. So, and the queen is there. Like she's in my eye line. Yeah. And I say, look, everyone backstage is, is really nervous because we're going to meet royalty later on. And, you know, what's the etiquette? And then I looked at the queen and just went, just call me Mr. Carr. That's hilarious. And then five hours later, we're backstage. At like, we're not backstage. We're in Buckingham Palace having a drinks thing. Yeah. And I get a tap on my shoulder. Yeah. And it's Prince William. And he goes, Mr. Carr. <gasps> it's very sweet. sweet. But the reason for that story is yeah. we're walking back afterwards and I'm with Ed Sheeran, who I know a little bit. And we actually, there's a couple of stories here. I'll tell you royal stories. So we're walking back to the palace and Ed Sheeran goes, this house is fucking amazing. How, mu how much money has the queen got? And I went, motherfucker, she's on money. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. She's, she's on, on money. She, yeah, pull, money. Out, pull out a bill. All right, I'll get to the funny bit of the Wait, story. So but, but, we're, with, we're with Stevie Wonders there with us, right? Uh -oh. And we all have to go back on. Motherfucker for a, can see. Go uh, ahead. A mm. curtain call at the end. Uh -huh. So this is where it gets to. So we have to do a curtain call and they're singing the national anthem. We're very patriotic. Um, and we're walking back on the stage and Stevie Wonders is just in head, uh, ahead of us with his uh, hand on his guy. And he goes, I don't know this fucking song. And I go... It's on prompt. It's on auto cue. And he goes, motherfucker. And then he gets out his harmonica just for me and Ed uh -huh. and riffs over the top of the, the national anthem just for us. Just, wow. just as a little treat for us. What a guy. Wow. What a guy. I didn't realize until recently, Stevie Wonder was, you know, the happy birthday song. Yeah. yeah. Happy birthday to you. It's about Martin Luther King. And uh. that was part of the, um, he was part of the, the whole uh, movement to have MLK Day. I didn't realize oh. he was such a huge part of that. No, I didn't know that either. Yeah. Incredible. I didn't, I didn't know that isn't she something's about his daughter. I think people always play that for like their oh. girlfriends. And Sweet Caroline is about having a baby. I didn't know that either. And it's about his friend had a baby and it's about that that baby. Wow. I mean, like the, being thrilled with it. Yeah. Born in the um, USA is anti-Vietnam. When you get booked though. We all knew do that. They, so. do they, <laughs> sorry. No, because we're, talking, we're talking here. Yeah. So <gasps> Wait, Jimmy, yeah. I have a no, question. No, no, no. no, no, no. Are, the, let men. Is it about seven up again? Jesus. But, but about the English Can accent. Listen, about the monarchy, their accent though, like what is, is that just like so insular because they, they don't talk like anybody else in London. No, so what fuck, what is that fucking accent? That's a received. That's how I mean, they everyone say Everyone used too. to speak like that. They go, look, what's up with our fucking accent? Yeah. Are they literally only taught that, that accent is what I'm saying. Like, I do mean, they, the, I think they're surrounded by those people. Just right? those posh. I guess. It's just the poshest accent. Yeah. It's pretty posh. Does it have a word? Like, is it, is it called? Like the Very poshest posh. ass accent. Like yeah. what the fuck is it called? Posh motherfuckers. It's Yo. always those, it's strange with the British accent more because there's certain like, uh, like spellings of things that are there to catch you out. Yeah. So, like Gloucester. Yeah. Man wearing is mannering and there's kind of. Yeah. Yeah. Gloucester, Leicester Square. It's, yeah. So then if it's not Gloucester. Worcester, Worcester sauce. All those things of like, if you got it wrong, but a giveaway. There's something I yeah. love that Brits say that you never hear Americans say. It's just, I mean, just this word is shall. I shall. I shall. You'll never hear ever. Americans say, we say Fortnite a lot more than I you I like as well. Fortnite. Yeah. yeah. I, I like Fortnite. You like Fortnite? You know why? Why? Because I feel super smart when I'm like, that's two weeks. I know yeah. that from Shakespeare. <laughs> I learned that. So... <laughs> Jimmy, just excuse It is, her. right? A fortnight is two weeks. Y y yes. Yeah, Jimmy, but he, a lot of motherfuckers don't Jimmy, know that. Jimmy, please forgive her. So, um, <laughs> does your mother have a question about her? Don't be retarded. So, um, <laughs> hello, governor. Here's the thing I wanted to ask. So this happens <laughs> to all of us for different for different gigs, you know, um, where you're getting booked for something and they go like, hey, when you do something that's like for the British royal family and <laughs> also for 100, 250,000 people and millions at home, but you're also like, I know when yeah. you're like on stage, do they go, hey man? Or do you just <laughs> intuitively go, I'll, I'll not, I'm, I'm not going to talk about the queen's pussy. Like, yeah. do you <laughs> just go, don't worry? Or, oh, do, they, there, or do they say, I was there please? Like doing like a three minute thing uh -huh. while they changed the drum riser for Grace Jones singing in a hula hoop. <gasps> uh -huh. It was crazy. I mean, it was a crazy kind of afternoon, but yeah, they, you know, be a professional. Also, yeah. if you want to be a badass, yeah. don't take the gig. 
Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Right. Me three days yeah. before, yeah. when do you want to come to this thing at the palace? Yeah, of course, great, fun. Yeah. Or if I get sat next to the queen yes. at lunch, yeah. fucking talk right. about nice stuff. Sure. Don't talk about a pussy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I do <laughs> have lunch true. with the queen on on the regular. Do you? I like Camilla a great deal. Yeah. yeah. Do you? Very fun. Really? Ve- genuinely very fun. I can't tell if you're fun. being serious. A great sense serious. of humor. He is being serious. Great Wait, sense of humor. You fucking have. She's 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 genuinely. But she's, she's I'm so into the monarchy. Really fun. Like likes stand That's up. That's what I hear. Likes fun. Likes jokes. Likes drinking. Like just a f- good time. Can I can I tell you why? Because uh, I'm deep into the history of whenever it's believed that her family growing up they were very loose. They're very wealthy. Whatever, and mm. they would just sit around and have parties and talk. And she's very. Mm. She was raised essentially to be what, and like a nice, social, gracious person, and she's she's universally loved. Apparently, when you meet her, you're just charmed. Yeah, she's she's nothing but good. Now, news. what about old Dudsy's the husband, though? Oh, Charles is great. Char Char's fun. Char- Charles is like a genuinely kind of a polymath. If you meet him, I don't even know what that word is. But bro. He knows an awful lot. Okay, so he's been at a lunch and a dinner every day of his adult life, right? Since he was whatever a kid. I heard he skips yeah. a meal to stay. Thin. He does, yeah. But yeah. his thing of like going, uh, he sat next to the most interesting guy in the room at every dinner. Right. So That's his cool. breadth of knowledge, it's kind of like that thing of like he just talk about anything and he goes, oh yeah, I know a little bit of that. And he was so far ahead of the curve mm. uh, in terms of going. It's very rare to have an Irish guy this this pro royalist, but he was so far ahead of the curve in terms of like non-GM and being good to the environment and, you know, all these kind of talking to plants. He was kind of viewed as a joke mm. in the 80s and 70s, talking about the, the environment all the time, which yeah. about the environment and things. But he runs a, ma- I mean, he's a farmer, really. He's really into that stuff. Mm. Now, what about, I'm going to bring them up. Sure. Old Megsy, Meggy and- And Harry. Yeah. Harry. Yeah. I don't know how well Harry that's... Styles and no. I what about know. what about Megan and, Har- and how, what's I, the sentiment? What's the pulse in the UK about them right now? I don't. It seems she's a right cunt. <laughs> it good? seems very. I mean, it's my joke about her. I think it's a pretty good joke. I said Meghan Markle is, of course, a lifelong feminist, which she's demonstrated <laughs> by marrying a prince and giving up her job. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's I, I'm not. I'm not sure. I mean, his th- the big thing Harry's done, which is brilliant, is the Invictus Games which is this thing with injured servicemen where it's a bit like the Paralympics, yeah. but specifically for servicemen and giving them kind of a, a, a platform where they can perform uh, physically and compete. And it's, it's pretty fucking awesome. Yeah, that's cool. But Invictus is from the Latin, not a victim. Ooh, I like and that. And it strikes me that he, the, the card he's playing is yes. I'm a victim. Oh, and you right. go, yeah. no, yeah. Yeah. you're not a fucking victim. <laughs> what are you know. talking about? Sure. D- d- what? Yeah. Like whinging about, oh, I can't get police protection when I come back to Britain or something. I, I, man, cry me a river. But he's not in the royal family anymore, and that's only given to the royal family. You just have to pay for your own fucking security. If you're uh, not working, why would they give you protection? I, it's I, logical. I don't, I don't know. I mean, I listen, I wish them well. I hope he has a great life, and I hope, he, I hope she has a great life. Ooh, they seem like nice that's people. That's the British version of bless your heart. That is yeah. British, I wish bless them your heart. Well, yeah. Let's go fuck yourself. Yes, yeah. it yeah. is. It's totally No, it but is. listen, yeah. he's off doing his thing. I'm not sure... <laughs> I'm not. I'm not sure. I need to be told. But also, what people say when they break up, they're like, "Yeah, I hope she's great, and I hope she has a very, very happy yeah. future." I've got a whole bit about in the show Fuck about uh, the sometimes, sometimes in life, yeah, you um, you have to apologize. But yeah. what you want to say is "fuck you." Yeah. yeah, and there's a phrase for that. I'm sorry you feel that way. Oh, yeah. it's, it's you know what you mean. Yeah. They know what you mean. They can't touch you for it. Right. I'm sorry you feel that yeah. way. Yeah. I'm sorry if what I said made you feel a certain way too. I'm sorry if what I said that was entirely fine made you feel like a dick. American Airlines, you fucking cunt. Yeah. 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 Jimmy Carr, can I ask you another retarded question? Sure. When you meet- I don't think you couldn't. Oh, I can't, yeah. (laughs) That'd be the more interesting thing. (laughs) Okay, so when you're meeting the royal family for the first time, are you briefed on how to- curtsy do yes. you bow they who, how does who it, how does ma'am, a guy comes in uh an ecury comes in before and says a what ecury a, what's an ecury uh, personal assistant word. to the okay. royalty um and you would say uh same ma'am ma'am rhymes with jam okay not mum because they say not mom 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 yeah, mom. 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 yeah. Hey, so rhymes with jam. women ma'am. are always um it's been i, I would say well talked about that women are supposed to curtsy and everything but what what do they tell a man when yeah, you're so, meeting so a woman so i've never actually heard you know what i mean like behavior greeting wise meeting yeah a royal. don't don't um i don't know don't 
turn your back. I think that's meant to be you're not meant to turn your back on the king or something. Uh-huh. Uh, what about the queen consort? I was told not to not to sit on the throne. Oh, oh. we went Fuck to a party yeah. at Clarence House, uh-huh. and I was told <gasps> not to sit on the throne. House. And then me and a guy called Jeremy Clarkson went and sat on the throne to took pictures. The, the top gear guy, <laughs> of course we did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were pretty hammered though. Yeah, sure. That's different. in fairness to us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dang. Yeah. So, so don't turn and don't your back. say like "What's up, dog?" Or can can you say that to the? <laughs> you king? can say "What's up, dog." <laughs> you can, yeah, that's. That's actually, that's the that's first thing. That's what I told her going. I want to say when I yeah. meet the, She's like, you'll meet him one day. Where's, your, where's, no. where's my dog's at? Yeah, where my dog's at? Yeah, yeah, no, no. Remember we said when you meet him, you have to go, hello, Gavna. Oh, yeah, yeah. That, she was like, you would not disrespect him like that. I go, sure I would. It, it, it doesn't have the same effect on me. It's not it's like a, I was it, raised there. Is there is a weird thing where everyone says that. Yeah. And then yeah. they meet them because like, it's the station that they have. It's the, it's the heritage. It's the head of state. I mean, a lot of people are like anti-royalty and saying we should get rid of those as the head of state. Sure. But as opposed to what? What right. do you want to put in their place? Because right. there is like a ceremonial role where someone kind of sketchy can come and visit the country mm-hmm. and they meet the royals. And it's kind of a way of dealing with that where it's not politicians. And politicians now, right. there's no statesman. Right. It's, but everyone's on a four-year cycle of trying to get re-elected, sure. re-elected, right. re-elected. Yeah. No one's making plans for the future or talking to people or you right. know, at that level, nations need to talk to each other. So there is kind of a role they play. There, For sure there is. Oh, you just watched a YMH highlight. Did you love it? Why don't you have more fun? Click around. Click here. Click there. Click everywhere. Put a clicker in your b-hole. Look. Try it out. Have more fun. Why don't you subscribe? That way, every time a video drops, you can be notified. You don't have to think about it. Just do it, man. You're not going to miss a moment of denim. Pull your jeans up. Subscribe.